What deficits do you see in the European Union as a democratic organization? Well, the European Union is an organization which in one way is profoundly democratic. It's made up of democratic countries. It's a condition of joining that you're a democracy. There's a risk of being thrown out if you stop being a democracy. Um, but making an organization of 27 countries work on a democratic basis, that's more difficult. Uh, if you have you follow democratic procedures and have majority votes, um, uh, it's normal in democracy, then what happens? It means that a country like Denmark, which is not very large, can be voted down. We make decisions then over the head of the Danish people. That sounds undemocratic. Um, on the other hand, if you don't do that, uh, you maybe don't make any decisions at all. Normally what happens in practice is that we work by consensus. There's give and take. Everybody knows that to make the system work, you have to compromise. Uh, everybody knows that if you're isolated, it's not that you give way, it's that you have to find a way around your problem. Uh, and everybody has to help each other, has to understand each other's problems. Um, but is the, uni is the European Union in a, a pure democratic organization? The answer to that is no, uh, because it's not a state doesn't operate like a state. It's a, it's, a, it's a collective, a community of states trying to work out their common future.